Hello, hello. My name is Emily of Emily's Aligned Fitness, and this is my very first video. Today, we're going to be going for a nice little warm up. It's going to be total body, and it's going to help you get prepared for whatever workout you are tackling today. Let's go ahead and get started. I want you to start with your feet a little bit wider than hip width apart and they're gonna be nice and parallel. So the toes shouldn't be turned out at all. They should be facing forward. Good, from there, lift all 10 of your toes. Spread them out as much as you can and then relay them down on the mat. Good, from there, I want you to think about lifting up through the inner thighs, pull the belly button in and back towards your spine and take your arms down at your side. So we're just gonna go for shoulder rolls. Lift the shoulders up, back and down. Good, inhale forward, up, exhale back and down. Two more like this. Good, inhale forward and up. Exhale back and down. And now we're just gonna reverse direction. So we go inhale back and up. Exhale forward and down. Good, you can close your eyes here. Maybe it's in the morning and you're not quite woken up just yet. Good, give me one more. Nice, and now relax the shoulders down at your sides. Inhale, sweep those arms up overhead. Good, if it's a little bit too uncomfortable to take them all the way up, a little further forward is fine. Inhale here. On the exhale, belly button pulls up. You're gonna dive forward. Good, think of a banana peel, peeling off of banana, rolling all the way down. Good, head is heavy, neck is long. At the bottom, give me a nice soft bend in your knees. Inhale. Good, on the exhale, start to tuck your tailbone, pull the belly button in towards your spine and roll up nice and slow. We're just doing a little spinal mobilization here. Good, inhale, reaching those arms up. Exhale, diving forward. Imagine you've got a gigantic hoop right in front of you. You're trying to go over that hoop. Good, at the bottom, take a nice little bend in the knees. Relax for a moment, inhale, exhale, start to tuck the tail, pull up on that belly button. Nice, it's important to give the body some time to warm up. Not only so that you mentally feel more prepared, but also so that your body feels a little bit more ready for what's about to happen. Good, coming all the way down. Nice, at the bottom, bend your knees. Just stay here for a second, keep breathing easy. Inhale, start to nod your head, yes. Good, exhale, shake your head, no. Good, inhale, once again, nod your head, yes. Let's end on a positive note. And then exhale, start to tuck that tailbone, roll all the way up. Nice, once you come all the way to the top, I want you to roll your shoulders back. Inhale, reach that right arm up, and then go ahead and give me a nice side bend. Again, we're imagining that something is next to us. We're trying to arch over whatever is next to us. Inhale, on the exhale, restack center. Inhale, opposite arm comes up and over. We're gonna do this one more each side. See if you can really separate the ribs up and over off those hip bones. Inhale, exhale, back center. Good, and then inhale, side bend. Good, breathing into those side ribs. Exhale, come center. And then inhale, last one, over to the right. Good, inhale here. And then exhale, go ahead and come all the way back center. From there, I want you to go ahead and come to one side of your mat, doesn't matter which side. Ground down through your feet. Inhale, one final roll down to take us into that plank, chin to chest, roll down for me. Good, at the bottom, soft bend your knees, and then plant those palms, walk them all the way out to find your high plank. Good, high plank, we're gonna have our shoulders over the wrists. We're gonna have those legs lengthen back behind us, pull your belly button in, and then squeeze your bum here a little bit. Nice, from here, I just want you to come onto your tippy toes and send your butt up towards the ceiling. So look, my tippy toes, I'm sending my butt back. We've got a downward facing dog. Now press your heels down. From there, lift your heels up, ripple forward, find your high plank. Good, reaching the hip bones towards the sky, press the heels down, good, tip toes, and then you snake forward into that high plank. Good, two more like that. We're really working with fours today. Good, ripple forward. Again, mobilizing the spine here. Also warming up the core. Last one. Good, coming all the way forward. Nice, from here, I want you to keep that left foot planted. You're gonna take your right knee in towards the chest, so just the right knee. Notice my hips didn't drop, they didn't lift. They're staying nice and even. Good, from there, I want you to tap your right knee to the mat, inhale, and then exhale, lift the hips, come onto your tippy toe. Hold here for just a second. Can you scoop your knee a little bit tighter into your belly? Good, you tap and lift. Good, inhale, tap, exhale, lift. One more like this, good, inhale, tap. Good, exhale, lift. Now find that plank, step your right foot back, reset for a second if you need to drop down to your knees, fine by me. If you've still got that uh, plank working, we're gonna stay with it. I want you to take a big step forward with that same foot, that right foot, to replace your right hand. Big step forward, you replace the right hand. Look at you, nice work. All right, from there, you're gonna open up to the side. I'm turning away from you, but I'm still with 
feet. Reach those right fingertips up towards the ceiling. Lengthen out that back left leg. So look at that left knee. We don't want it soggy. We want it nice and strong. Good. From there, you're gonna come back center. If you have the mobility today, you can tap your right elbow to the ground. If not, then you can go ahead and just place the right hand for a second. And then we twist back open. Again, power of four today. So we're gonna do this two more times. Tap. Good. Open, strong back knee, you got this. Good, tap. And open. We got one more like this, stay with me. Good, tap and open, nice. Now from here, I want you to take your right hand down, just your right fingertips, walk your right foot slightly more center, and then take your left foot just ever so slightly up. All right, we're gonna power through that right foot, come all the way up into this nice high runner's lunge. Good, roll the shoulders back, hold it here. Good, for three, we're gonna take the palms down, in two, and one, good, palms down. Right foot comes back to a hover. Good, right foot steps in. Reach up into that nice, powerful runner's lunge. Good, tap the hands down. Reach that leg back. Two more, power of four, you got it. Good, so now you should start to feel a little bit of heat. We're working that mobility. We're also really starting to work the musculature. Good, come all the way up. That was our fourth from here. I want you to reach those palms back, and then reach the palms forward. Good, no soggy back knee. Good, reach it forward, you got two more. If you start to lose your balance, it's fine. It's normal to wobble. Good, we're not statues here, we're humans. Good, reach those arms forward. From there, take the palms down. Good, hold it. Hold it here. For three, for two, and one. Good, from there, I want you to start to crawl yourself over to the opposite side. It's not cute, but it's really functional. Good, from there, I want you to step your left foot back now to meet your right, you're in your nice high plank. Again, if you need to take a second on your knees, take that second on your knees. We're gonna do the same thing on the opposite side. So that left knee comes in. Good. From there, you're gonna tap the mat and then lift up, up, up. Good, inhale, tap. Exhale, up, up, up. Good, you got two more. Really scoop the belly in. Taking an ice cream scooper to your abs here. Tap and lift. Good, now here, you're gonna go ahead and step that left foot forward, replace your left hand. Now that left arm stretches towards the ceiling. Again, I'm reaching away from you, but I, I'm still with you. And you're still with me, I hope. Good, from there, take the left elbow down. You can tap the mat if you've got the mobility. If not, you can just tap that left hand down, no big deal. Reach up, good, twist, twist. Come back center, tap. Good, reach up, two more. Is that back knee soggy? No, it's starchy, it's strong. Good, last one here, reach. Nice, now from there, you're gonna walk the left foot into the center a little bit. Left hand comes the outside of the left foot. You can come up onto your fingertips for just a moment. Walk your right foot in slightly, then drive down to your left heel, reach into this nice high runner's lunge. Now you can see in my ankle here, I'm wiggling, wobbling, again, normal. Good, go ahead and take those hands down to the ground. Step your left foot back to a hover. Good, stepping in. Nice high runner's lunge, reach those arms forward. Palms down. Good, two more. And lengthen. Belly in, good, arms up. Nice and arms down. Last one. Good, lengthen leg. Good, tap it in. Reach those arms up. Now flip the palms towards the outside. We press back, you press back. Switch, press forward. Good, press back. Press forward, warming up the back body here. You got two more, press. And press. Last one, good, press. And press nice. Now reach those arms down towards the ground. Take that left leg back. Once again, find your high plank. Now we're gonna get a little bit more into the arms. Step your legs wider than hip width apart. If you need to drop down to your knees, that's fine. Press your hips down, squeeze your glutes. We're gonna go into a series of shoulder taps. If you're on your knees, it's just like this. Trying to reduce the wiggle in the hips. If you're on your toes, same thing. Good, tap and tap. From here, we're gonna go into a set of push-ups just to close out our little warm-up. Now, you don't have to do this as a warm-up. You can do this as your workout, right? This is tough. I'm starting to sweat a little bit. If this is a bit too fast, feel free to take it at your own tempo. If it's too much, drop down to your knees. You got four, good, three, and two, and one, good. Now, drop down to your knees, everyone, please. We're gonna go into our set of push-ups. Push-ups are great, they are gonna work the entire body, secret to a push-up, something I want you to think about is it's just a moving plank, okay? 
So take your hands a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. Turn your fingers in slightly. I'm talking like ever so slightly. Good. From there, walk your knees back. We'll start on our knees and then press your hips down. So my shoulders should be over my wrists. My fingers are ever so slightly turned in. Wrap the pointy parts of your elbows back. Squeeze your bones. Good. From there, we're going to bend the elbows to a nice A shape. So back on the diagonal, come all the way down and then press all the way up. Good, keep squeezing the butt. You go down, you go up. Good. Now we can stay on our knees. If this is you, it's a very shallow push up, that's fine. I promise it's gonna get deeper as you go. If you're going all the way down to your chest and you feel like, man, Emily, I could be doing this for an eternity. I want you to pop up onto your toes. You're ready for it, okay? Here we go. We go down and up. You see for me it's hard. Go down and up. We're gonna go two more. Down, we're gonna meet in a plank. Knees or toes, it's your call. Go down and up. Knees or toes, it's your call. 10 seconds, you got 10. Good. Nine, this is it here. Can you walk those legs a little bit closer together? Zip your ankle bones together. You got five and four. We're gonna finish strong together in three. Good, two and one. Good, lower those knees down. Separate your knees a little bit wider than hip width, hip width apart. Heels are together. Reach those hips towards your heels. Find a quick child's pose. Inhale, exhale, tuck the tail on, roll all the way up. All right, so that is your warm up or it's your full body workout for the day. Whichever way you choose, I'm proud of you. You nailed it. Listen, I hope you have a great rest of your day. I hope the next thing that you tackle, you feel a little bit stronger. Bye bye.